Members will not be surprised to say, and I'm sure they've heard, that Labour does have a plan. And the, the uh, member for Safe for South Cambridgeshire referred to our, our, um, our plan for the NHS. Labour will double the number of medical school places from 7,500 to 15,000 and train 10,000 extra nurses and midwives every year, double the number of district nurses qualifying each year and create 5,000 more health visitors paid for by abolishing non on tax status because, Sir George, patients need treatment more than the health, um, the wealthiest need a tax break. They might not got very much time, so I'm going, to, I'm going to continue, I'm afraid. The government could have adopted Labour's policy, which the Chancellor himself said he agrees with. In the email to supporters of the patient safety charity he founded, he wrote, I quote, the medical school places increase is something I very much hope the government adopts on the basis that smart governments always nick the best ideas of their opponents. So I would be grateful if the minister could set out why their party has decided not to listen to their own chancellor.